hello everyone so welcome back to this channel once again and in this video session i'll discuss how we can declare printer files in fixed format rpg versus fully free rpg so let's see so Let me check it again. I think I missed the example. Okay. This one. Let me show you. So uh, here I am defining a printer file named print uh, PRTF1. So let's see this is an let's say this is an uh, external printer file and it is defined for in output mode. So basically we are going to write the data in the printer file. Uh, that's uh, going to be a spool file. And uh, here we need to use the keyword printer for printer file because uh, since we use we were using uh, disk keyword for the disk file excel file and here we can also associate an indicator overflow indicator using the offline keyword so either i can associate indicator 0 1 till 99 so i n 0 1 0 2 till i n 99 i can associate any indicator so you can see uh, this is an optional keyword offline so if i am earned uh, using this uh, overflow indicator then, uh, then i'll be using this otherwise i won't be declaring this keyword with the printer files um, so let's see how we can uh, declare the same in the free format rpg so this one so let's see. Uh, here, first line, first column, star star free. Then we will use dcl f op code to declare this printer file. So prtf1 is the printer file name, and then using the printer keyword for the printer file. And if overflow indicator is specified, then we will be specifying the overflow indicator using the offline keyword, and will be passing the parameter as the overflow indicator being used between i n zero one to i n ninety nine. Um, I now the most important thing here is uh, for the usage style output so this uh, the default usage for the printer file is output so this is a uh, default so an optional to use so the preferred way to declare a printer file is this one uh, if you want we can uh, declare like this as well that's also correct but since it is optional and default uh, uh, default for the disk file is input and default for the printer file is output so we don't need to de declare this keyword here so that's the motive view to show you uh, that how uh, differently we can uh, declare this uh, for any uh, program described printer files which are declared in post spec uh, we won't be using this IN01 till 99 indicators there we will be using uh, IN08 till IN0G and IN0V indicator we will be using these indicators to uh, get the or to represent the overflow happened on the page a school file so that's all here so thank you and have a nice